Hey guys, it's Wolf of Valhalla Gaming and we are back in Cliff Empire. But before we start, I'm gonna need y'all to click that like button, hit that subscribe, and ring the bell. And you know the cities already. And if you don't, they're up here in the top. And we're still working on getting this eco barrier finished. We have one of them done, which is right here. It's a very interesting device. I'm not sure how it's supposed to be an eco barrier, but that's what we got. Tiny so we're gonna work on these other two. We got one that's at 74. And then we got one over here that's at 55. So we're just gonna speed them up. And they should get done in a little bit. And while we do that, um, I'd like to get rid of this nuclear power, but honestly, we kinda need it right now. It's kinda helping us during the nighttime. A lot because we use 533 batteries at night. Oh, that's so much. That's a lot of batteries. Ooh. That's fine. <clears throat> I apologize. Something in my throat. That's not too bad, actually. What we have. I think we got more of our. These built. Yeah, these are all brand new, I think. So, what? This is building gadgets. So, we're going to make more gadgets. We're gonna make a crap ton of gadgets, and then what What do you make? You make furniture? Yeah. And then you make appliances. So we'll make a bunch of appliances. Perfect. And we're just gonna turn all of these into these big stores over here that we need. So we can keep our furniture and everything happy. And everybody's happy. And a happy cliff is a productive cliff. Even though we're not really in a cliff, we're in a valley. Not really sure how this works. Um, yeah, we're getting there. But now that we have stuff we can put up here, we can build some on-the-wall stuff. So what do we want to put on the wall? What do we want to put on the wall? <clears throat> Could do some vertical battery stick. We might do some more uh, green energy over there on that one. That'd be really interesting, have an entire wall of just energy. What if we did... Ooh, we could do a waterfall on the wall, couldn't we? Let's do hotels. We need more hotels, right? They make money. They get people to come see us. They're just nice. So we're going to put a hotel on the very edge over here. And we're going to kind of turn this cliff into like a boardwalk. So we'll do one on the very edge over here. And those are going to get built. And we have more jobs than we have people again. Seems to be a common occurrence here. Uh, we can't do that though because Valhalla needs more people still. Oops. We need to open. We need to, we need to defrost some peoples. Can we defrost more? Oh yeah, let's just keep defrosting. Oh, not enough resources. Okay. Yeah, Valhalla took a big hit to its uh, people's population because I guess there's not an infinite amount of people or... Maybe- Oh, they built so many bridges! Look at this! They're connected in so many ways! That's interesting. I didn't see that earlier. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Temperature rise expected. And it means there's gonna be a few days of fires. Not really my problem. So let's, uh, see. So another way we can increase population, actually, is if we scroll over here to our medical center. And you can see we've had 36 people born, but a bunch of people have died. We've had 8 from old age, uh, 21 people died from diseases, and then 40 people have died from fires, which is not ideal. But we can, we can get more people born. We can influence some things, if you know what I mean. Go over here, and it uh, stimulates birth rates. I don't know if we're putting out uh, certain videos for free or stuff like that, but it is what it is. And uh, it, it costs a lot of money, but uh, it's going to boost our birth rate, which means we're going to have more people here. And it's nice, because, you know, we don't have to worry about getting people from Valhalla. We can just have people here. Does Valhalla have a birth rate, now that I think about it? People being born here, I mean, Trading these people are living in, like, isolation on a space station, I assume. 150 people born. 27 have died from old age and 7 from fire. Okay, okay, Valhalla, y'all kind of, okay. Guess there's no reproductive uh, 
not reproductive. I guess there's no counterceptives in space. We're just going to go with that. We're going to hop back over to the Ice Citadel. And see what we got going on here. What else can we put on our business area? I'm trying to think. I'm sorry. What could go in our business? We really shouldn't be able to do too much right now. Honestly, right now, manpower is taking a hit. We need people to be born. Uh, anybody? Else? Oh, we've got some more people being born. Yay. Trading do we have any homeless people? Life. Is there a way to see homeless people? Do we have homelessness? Um, I don't think there's a way to track homelessness, is there? Because we just have people being born. I don't think I can destroy these, though, right? Like, yeah, I can't destroy these. So even if I wanted to isolate Valhalla from the ground, I couldn't do it. So I'm not sure how we're going to do this. We just have to let people be born here, I guess. And because this is our housing... Huh. So it gets a little bit more difficult when you just have to let the population do its own thing. We've had 41 people born, though. we got that going for us. Let's check on that eco-barrier, shall we? Ooh, this one's almost done. That one's 90% complete. It's getting done fast. 92%. they got to bring eight more things over. Uh, we got holes in the ozone. We got a glitchy cliff over here. Got a truly in my hand, and the temperature is rising quickly. Industrial facilities can overheat. Put all your forces on fire protection. Can you choose what they're doing? Like, if I go over here to these people, can I tell them to be on fire protection? See, I can't. Or is there a law that you can sign into? Building is on fire. There's disaster mode. That doesn't do any good for us. Overproduction. That does nothing for us. Water savings. I would love to do because we had that water issue here a few episodes ago. Uh, yeah, none of this is for firefighting. So how do we prevent fires? California. Oh, I can't ask them for help. They're, they just constantly have fires. Oh no. This is what happens when you have a fire, though. These guys kind of just... go about their way and spray water all over everything. So we're just going to speed up through that, because regardless of the fires, we have enough... Building is on fire. Uh, what, what is it called? Is on fire. Uh, we maintenance, industrial, whatever, we is on fire. almost have enough. Is on fire. Reason we Building really don't have enough is because, Building I should probably on put fire. one of these to sleep. Let's try and get this to match up to this, so let's put a few buildings to sleep. Uh, I'm gonna leave my mega drills active, actually. And I'm just gonna put some of these bigger... Yeah, you see how many people these office buildings take? And yeah, now we got 28 unemployment because we got some sick people. People are still sick because of the weather. How do I fire. fix that? Building is, on fire. is there a way to fix that? Building is on fire. I don't care about all these fires. Every one of my Building cities has fire. adequate fire protection. Alright. So this is just health care in general. Building is on fire. So we got food, water, uh, ecological status, vitamins and minerals. Um, we just lost a lot of power. Holy crap. Why did we lose so much power? We just dropped down to 35% power. Do we... We got uranium. Oh, is it because our wind? Oh, yeah. Trading platform our wind's not generating their normal. Building is on fire. Okay, that's fine. We just have to survive a few days of heat here at, like, 70% power. Which isn't too bad if you learn how to do some of these things, because you can just come off over here, and we don't really need educational buildings. It puts a lot of people on employment, but it saves us on power. So, um... We just have to remember which ones we turned off. So we turned off unemployment, and then we can do... 
building well, bless you, fire. Radar. Building is on fire. I'm sorry, Radar sneezed. Is on fire. Yeah, we can just turn off a bunch of buildings. Building is on fire. And, uh... Yeah, it's not too bad. We get a lot of our power back during the day, at least. Um... Trading platform arrived. So this is unemployment benefits. Is on fire. Every hour... The amount of tax depends on the prestige of the city. Building Labor migrants pay tax by their place of inhabitants. Social fire. charges equal taxes Building minus unemployment. Fire. I don't know what any of that means. Is on fire. I don't do taxes. All I know is that taxes Building are theft, so we don't deal with those here. And Building I'd really like to get fire. rid of taxes. How many people have been Building born? Because I'm, I'm sure some people are dying to the fires here. That's Building a school. We put schools out of commission right now. Still only 41 people born here, so we're not doing too good. We we need some of that Valhalla level production of uh, reproducing. How many people born here? Still 150? Let's hop over to Helheim. Let's go to our oldest city, New Asgard. How many people have been born in this city since its inception? 324. That's not bad. That's literally like a fourth... No... A fifth of the population? Yeah, kind of. That's about a fifth of the population here has actual, like, residents from here. And we've had quite a few people die. We've had over... We've had over 300 people die. So I think that's an issue, is now we have... We have to figure out how to get people to have more kids. That's a disgusting thought. I don't like kids, but we need them. They are the next generation. Is so I don't know if that has to do with like maybe we need more entertainment. Do people have to get drunk to have kids? Is that what this is going on? Is that is that what the world Trading platform is that is that what the world has come to? You just have to get drunk to have a kid. I mean, I can understand getting drunk to deal with the kid. Is on fire. Anyway, we're about to finish our second eco barrier over here, and I haven't even started touching on what I'm going to do with this one. So let's get back fire. to this eco barrier. Building is on fire. Because our ecology here is 230%. We can do whatever we want. So, we're going to do... Building is on fire. Let's do a wall garden. Underclip construction completed. We'll do a wall garden. Building is on fire. Right there. And then a wall garden Building right here. Because we know I love my on-the-wall structures. Building is on fire. And we finished our second eco barrier, which is over here in the industrial area. So I think for this, oh my nose itches. I'm so sorry. I think for this, I think it is going to be a defensive area as well. So we're going to mount some interceptors on either side. And then I really don't know how to tell where the middle one is. Is on fire. So it's kind of kind of rough, but we're going to do interceptors fire. and then we're going to do some rocket launchers right building next to them. Fire. That way we can launch our interceptors, have some rocket cover, and that'll really building cover this fire. area with those heavier Objective defenses. Alright, objective was completed. Awesome, so now we can unsleep a lot of those power... Oh no, put those back to sleep. Um... Entertainment back on. Education back together. Matter mining? Why were you ever turned off? Oh no. Okay. Oh, I apologize. Okay, now we got one more eco barrier to do, and it is at 82, 83%, I think, right now? Yep, 83%. So while we do that, we're gonna. Oh, look at those waterfalls. That's so pretty. Should we do another. What's our tourism right here? We got 15 out of 30 tourists visiting. So let's, uh, oh my, okay. So let's see, what else can we build on this little, let's do, ooh, we could do a monument. Oh, that'd be so pretty. Monument overlooking the entire city. We could do some wall houses too. Could you imagine living here and you wake up every morning and this is your view? Trading Wait, eh, eh, eh. okay. About right here would be your view every morning. That'd be a hell of a view. I want a house like that now. 
On wall construction completed. And we've got On wall construction completed. some of our interceptors and wall mounted rocket launchers built now. So we are much more heavily defended now. Let's see. You know, I'm going to let y'all decide for this one. What do y'all want to see on this ring of the Ice Citadel? It's going to be population related, so hotels, gardens, housing, things like that. And then this one is clearly going to be more energy related, so I'll probably do some weapons on either side, some defensive structures. And then a plethora of on-the-wall trading platform arrived. solar stations and wind turbines because the wind turbine ooh, actually the wind turbines when you put them up there you can put machine guns or other stuff on them so they they kind of serve as a double a double uh defensive structure not a def defensive structure but they serve as like a building ground this is at 90 percent, so we're almost done with this i'm so curious to see what the next challenge is is that 92 percent already yeah, 92%. So I'm going to let y'all decide what to do with the population-related eco-barrier over the city. We've got the um, energy eco-barrier, and then we're going to have the industrial one, which I really don't know what to do with the industrial one either, because we don't have industrial on-the-wall items. I guess I could do some more food crops here. I could, ooh, that would save so much space. I could move our vineyards and everything to this. Ooh, and that guy just came. What are you doing? Why are you? What? Are you selling things to the appliance store now? What the hell? My storage is down here, guy. Also, I don't know what to do with this, like, little area right there. What am I, what am I supposed to do with that? Ooh, could do that. But if I'm going to do that, I might as well make something out of it that produces stuff, so, right? We'll do that. Perfect. What is my, like, supply status every day? Um. Jeez. Trading Looks like we're positive everything, so we got that going for us. That's all that really matters, right? Now, I don't know why I didn't do that right here, too. I could have just built one of those right there. It's because I'm not thinking. That's why. Clear answer to the stupid questions. Actually, I think right here we're going to do a more industrial... Like I said, it's going to be industrial on the wall. But it's also going to be like we can do... Because this generates 20. So if we did like another... Two of these on either side. Because then we can put machine guns over them. And I could build these in the exact same order. On wall construction completed. So I could do that, and then I could do some more defenses on them. Trading I think the defenses, wall. though, are kind of like overkill on them right now, honestly. On wall if I did completed. that, and then another missile silo. Oh, that's right, missile silos are dug into the ground. I can't. Under cliff construction completed. A shoreline building project. Completed. On wall construction what? Completed. We get to build on the shoreline now? Oh. Small construction what? Completed. Oh, this is going to be awesome. We get a boardwalk for our areas. This is awesome. How many areas is it? Is it just one? On wall construction I think this is all one area, and then I think this is another shoreline area. Small construction completed. So they're both 1% done right now? Or is it just... Construction completed. Are they both can't tell if they're two individual well, priority one you so it's just one giant project so as it lands new material look at that we're gonna get additional building space on the oh that's awesome we're gonna have more shoreline that means we're gonna have like a tiered area right here too with our industrial park or not our industrial but our um financial park we're gonna have a tiered area Speaking of which, do we have uh, more births going on? I remember I requested more people to be born. <laughs> uh, could you imagine the president going on TV and just being like, look, we need more people. Y'all know what to do. <laughs> my guys, my guys, y'all know what to do. 
Can we defrost some more people? Yeah. Defrost, 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 defrost. Yeah, there we go. Now we're getting some people here. Not enough resources. But look, now we've got... Trading platform arrived. I can't see how many people we've got. But we've got people here now. <laughs> Actually, I can kind of... Does this give me my population? No. Okay. Well, we're going to hop back over to the Ice Citadel. Because now we have the harbor, I guess. I don't know what we're going to call it. The boardwalk? It's already 4% complete, too. That's pretty good. That's not too bad. So that's the boardwalk. That's going to put us at 28 out of 29 points for this final piece of a beacon. The beacon of hope that I want. So this is going to give us almost the beacon of hope. And I was really thinking about maybe putting the beacon of hope where this I had the Notre Dame. Because I think the Beacon of Hope should be the center of the city. Notre Dame can go over here with the other super historical site that I have. Ooh, it's not going to fit. Is it? Trading Actually, it would fit. I just have to... Like... I just have to get rid of like some of these streets. Oh, I forgot these are individual ones, aren't they? We're just going to do this, and then do a bunch of this, and we're going to see what happens here when I put the, because it's a three wide, so it has to go right here, and then right here. And we're still going to put it to sleep, but that's the Notre Dame now, that's where that's going to go. I'm probably saying that wrong, if I am, let me know. I'm pretty sure that the pedestrian street... Yeah, it's going to be too small right here. Oh, that's why, because it's just a weird shape over here. Tiny construction completed. So if we do all of this weird and Tiny then demolish that all down there, and we just kind of rebuild Trading the road down. here, it'll work eventually, okay? Oh no, season of strong winds. I'm not selling you gadgets. Oh, it wants batteries. We can do batteries. Okay. We're just gonna hop over to our... How many batteries do we have here? What's our batteries like right now? We got 21. We use our batteries here a lot. We gotta sell 168. Let's hop over to New Asgard, though, because we're still selling stuff from here. What's our battery situation look like here? 139. So if we do a one-time sale of 168, we should be perfectly fine. And make sure that's selling to Valhalla now. <laughs> oh, sorry. And then we're going to speed it up, and I'm going to hop back to the Ice Citadel. And we're going to get on with this build. How's our boardwalk looking? 9% done. Love it. Tiny construction completed. Oh, we're getting there. Just anywhere. Is it going to take up, like, the entire waterway? Oh, boy. We're going to have so much area. So let's fix this massacre of... Freaking... Since I massacred all of my... Oh, boy. You can do that there. That there. Oh, boy. Oh, that's because these are like a weird shape, aren't they? I wish they gave you one block roads. That's if the developers ever watch any of my videos, which is would be amazing. Um, can you add that in, please? Like, I would love having a one block road so we don't run into these issues that I've just run into where I have to do this. And I pretty much just end up rebuilding an entire area like that for... I don't know, let's put in a bus stop over here. Can I put a bus stop in over here? I could probably put a bus stop in over here. Yeah, we put a bus station in right there. There, we made it work. It's just not pretty. And the Notre Dame can be right here, and then we can... I don't know. Do some housing or something. Oh god, why is that that way? Ugh. I take it back, I take it back, rebuild it. I take it back. Rebuild. Okay. So I guess we're going to have to put a road right there. That's a later occurrence. How's our... 
How's this guy going? 14% already. We are getting there. I like it. We are... Our power supply is a little iffy, though. Um, we got our wind over here. We're going to put some more guns up on top. Some more... More of these guys. And then I'm going to roll over here, and I'm going to build some more of these wind turbines. Because we do have... 115% windiness on a normal day anyway, so we can do some on the wall and we're going to do some wind turbines and we're going to do something here. We're going to do one, two, three, five. We're going to do five and five. One, two, three, four, and five. And then next to those, we're going to do some battery stations. I forget, these require jobs too. So I'm adding more jobs, even though I'm trying to avoid it. I don't really think we need battery stations right now. We're not making enough charge. Maybe once these get done, we will. But um, until that happens, maybe not. Did I put... Oh, I did put one of my... These guys to sleep. See, I, I just can't. I'm sorry. I need my peoples here. Do I have enough... We have enough gadgets, we can start. We have way too much of everything. Unfrost, 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 unfrost. Oh, we're unfrosting so many people. We've got 1,200 work places. We've got, or 1,250, we've got 18, it looks like 1,185 right now. So we're getting there. Eventually we'll have the Ice Citadel back to full capacity of peoples. Building is on fire. Building is on fire. Why is a building on fire? I feel like it's because I don't have enough of my uh, emergency resources here. So we're going to add in another maintenance Small center. Ooh, yay. My machine Small guns. That's going to be pretty epic seeing these guys firing out over the city now whenever they have to defend. That's going to be pretty awesome. Trading platform arrived. We get any of these guys done? We got one done. Can we get the other, like, nine done? Please and thank you. We got 90 manpower. That's not too bad. Because on top of... Ooh, I could do shield generators on top of these and really protect them. But we all know the best defense is a good offense, so we're just going to put some multi-missile launchers up here. Could I do that? Oh, I probably could if I angled it like that. Oh. Those enemy fleets are in trouble. I could also put some maintenance centers up here too now. That's why I like using these though. They give me that little bit of extra building area. Um, I do think I want to put some of my... I really like how I have my agricultural area. I don't want to put them up here. I may put some housing or something up here. The poor people. <laughs> you live next to the mega trail. We're not doing too bad. Our city's doing well. We're, we don't have enough gadgets. We never have enough gadgets. Gadgets are the bane of my existence. But look at this. We've got... We've almost got three of these warehouse thingies per... I didn't mean to put you to sleep. And these make debris because we need debris for these guys, I guess, whenever they're producing stuff. No, they need food. Yeah, they need food whenever they're doing their thing, which is fine. That is a lot of energy just stored in that shield, just waiting to be used. It's protecting. Trading platform arrived. I guess it makes sense, though, with what some of the stuff they're protecting is pretty important. Um, oh yeah, we sold enough batteries, okay. I was kind of worried we wouldn't get there. Not really too worried now. How's our... this guy's coming along nicely, 25 per... we're already one-fourth of the way there. That is nice. Very nice, very nice. Probably one more episode on that and we'll get the shoreline built up. Curious if it's gonna be like a boardwalk that just wraps around right here. Is that what it is? That's what it looks like. It looks like it's a boardwalk right here and then another one around right here. I don't know. Let's give the Ice Citadel some money. 
Um, are we getting some more people born here? I need some more people being born. We've had 51 births. I need more people being born than are dying, if you get what I'm saying, my guy. Radar, you are so obnoxious. Thank you. I love my dog. So let's see. Um, what's our economy here look like in this? 393 a day. Interesting. What if more people, if more people are born here? I'm curious, if more people are born here. Oh, that's negative 49 if I do that. That's pretty rough. Oh, that's because I'm also doing warranty repair? Ew. Why would I ever do this? Deactivate that. What is this? Introduce... Replace grapes. Why was I replacing grapes? Do I not have any vineyards? Oh, I must have gotten rid of vineyards here. That's a shame. I don't think I got rid of vineyards. They're on the wall, aren't they? Didn't I put vineyards on the wall over here? Or is it only salad? I only have salads on the wall? No, these are vineyard. No, those are salads. Interesting. I know I do have vineyards here. Why Why would I have that law in... I, I don't know why I'd have that law in effect if I have grapes here. Now we're making... more money. And we're making more people. Stimulating the population birth. The, yeah, that. We're gonna have baby boomers here. Alright, what about over here? Why, why are you asleep? Stop that. Okay. Let's look at what laws we have in place in this city. Um, yeah, screw the gadgets. Alright, so we're gonna make some more babies. Yeah, this episode's all about the birds and the bees. Why did I say that? I hate myself. Alright, let's see what we got going on here. We've had... Where's my city council? Hidden away? No. Do we not have higher form of government here? Oh yeah, it's over here. There we go. What do we got going on over here? Deactivate that. Sign that. Alright. We're not making much money off of taxes, but we're making a little bit of money. Those taxes really aren't going to the government. They're going back to the people in the form of reproductive stimuli. I have no idea what that is, but the government's figured it out, so we're gonna go with whatever they say. And how's our dock looking? I guess dock. Ooh, I can move all of our fishing stuff over here. That's gonna be nice. I can clear up this and have another... Ooh, we can have a continuous line of these. Yeah, giant, giant indus... not industrial. I'm curious if I shouldn't get rid of these residential complexes, though. And add more of these big towers. Because what? A residential upgraded. complex fully upgraded. Gives me 52 plus 28. That's 50, 60, 70, 80 people. 80 people when a one of these gives me 26, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Six. Um, that's a hundred and twenty-four. It's like a hundred and fifty and some change. So each one of these is essentially like two of these stacked on top of each other. So we may get rid of these and add some more just to uh, kind of continue it. What did I put right here? Modules found it. Oh, everything's kind of shifted. I just realized that. On wall construction Ugh. completed. That's ugly. I don't like how things are shifted. I guess it'll work, but I still don't like it. Bleh. Is that because modules are bigger than those? Is a module's foundation bigger than a norm? No, these are the same size. So how did? Oh, because this has this behind it. Okay, that makes sense again. Also, we had our on-the-wall constructions completed. Trading platform arrived. Um, most of them on this side. So we're going to see what we can add on this side now. So we could be adding... I guess we could... Can you put a matter mine on... T that would be funny. That would be entertaining. Trade portal. No. 
Just trying to see what's small enough. You could put a shuttle on top of them, though, I assume. Uh, if they were in the right angle. Recycling plant might fit on top, no? So let's just see. We have an approaching enemy fleet. Oh no, whatever will we do? Somebody, get me the big stick. So I didn't put any interceptors or anything over here, so we're going to throw in an interceptor. Trading platform arrived. And of course, a wall-mounted rocket launcher. And we're going to priority one them, because we have an approaching enemy fleet. We can't take any risks. And then I'm going to pop over here. And I've got another interceptor station. Piloted by some of the bravest pilots that you'd ever think of. And another another one of these guys. And actually, I want some more interceptors. I love interceptors. I just love the thought of these guys just diving out of this little hole in the wall on a cliff and just completely decimating an enemy fleet. Alright, so we're going to priority one all of our defenses. There's like no defenses over here, so I'm really... Maybe I should get rid of these hotels. Yeah, we're going to get rid of this corner stuff. It's unfortunate. Um, it was a lot of money to build, but... We're going to get rid of this stuff. We're going to put some defenses in each corner of this one. On wall construction completed. So let's get all this stuff out of the way. Priority one, all of it. On wall construction and we're going to throw interceptors at the very corner. Nope, 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 nope. Completed. Nope. Demolish. That wasn't in the very corner. So we're going to do an interceptor completed. station right here. And then we're going to do a rocket launcher next to it. And then to kind of cover it up, we're going to do a, uh, on the wall, we're going to do a vertical wind turbine next to it. Completed. And then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to do the same thing. So I'm going to do another interceptor. I can't do an interceptor right there because this debris Tree hasn't been taken wall. away yet. How are you telling me we don't? Okay. I'll do my wall mounted rocket launcher next to it. And then I will do my on the wall wind turbine and this is going to kind of hide just when you're on the eco barrier it's going to kind of just hide it away whether those things get done or not not really a priority i think the we really do have a lot of defenses here uh we can put oh, an interceptor well, station there easy. now we can priority one it and i think that's good yeah let this fleet show up. You know what we can put on top of these, though? We already talked about it, but we can put a shield generator right here. And it's going to protect our... I can't put one over here yet. Trading platform arrived. But that's going to protect our defenses and then some of our other stuff right here. New task here we received. go. Alright, so we're going to slow... We're going to pause first. It looks like Ice Citadel is the only one being targeted. It looks like we're getting hit by three fleets, three different directions. Is that one, two? It looks like three fleets. So we're going to slow it down. Uh, I've got one, two. Yep, there's all three of the fleets. Um, some of our on-the-wall stuff is still not completed yet. Some of our other stuff is. We do have weapons outbound already by the sounds of it. Yep, we've got engagements over here, interceptors. I won't say interceptors, but we do have a lot of rockets going out. And they are doing some heavy damage. It looks like we've got rockets flying off the wall over here as well now. None of our machine guns have kicked on yet, which means that we haven't... Oh, there we go. Flat cannons are online, and our shore-mounted missile batteries are engaging the threat. Now, I kind of want to watch this from, like... Oh. Get him. Get him. Shoot him. Oh, God, that's terrifying. Oh, there's... there's oh, God. There's so much. Shoot him down. Shoot him down. 
think those are like Corvettes. Our interceptors are actually doing a lot of damage. Ooh, the, that was... Ooh, he took a big hit. He took a big hit. He's going down. That's one of their carriers. You can see it carries their like little... Ooh, he got clipped by his own people. So glad it doesn't do any damage to our stuff. And even more of our defenses are being built now. Small construction completed. That was beautiful. And he falls. That was a beautiful defense. I don't think we lost our... Yeah, we didn't lose our resources. I don't think any of the other cities are taking... I don't think they can attack Valhalla. I think Valhalla is safe. So that's the direction of our Ice Citadel. You can almost get to it, I guess. So whenever things come from the Ice Citadel this way, they just have to... I don't know if it's since it's on the same map, if that jet that escaped is technically going to fly past us. I don't think he is. That was pretty epic, though. I liked that. That was pretty fun. Let's go ahead and speed up. How's our... Uh... We didn't lose anything, did we? That was pretty cool. We did get our defenses built, though, for the most part. Building is on fire. We have our on-the-wall shield generator now. Building is on fire. And next to the on-the-wall shield generator, Objective I just wanted completed. to kind of put some wind turbines. Trading platform Ooh, arrived. yay. Objective. But we'll do that another time. What are we looking at over here? We're almost... That looks like it's like, what, 49%? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. We have our on-the-wall stuff over here. So I'm going to add shield generators around these installations that I have for defensive measures. That way, anytime we get hit, those uh, facilities are protected and able to maintain and continue the fight, I guess is what I need to say here. So I'm going to put another two of these on-the-wall wind turbines over here. And we'll put some shield generators on top of those. Trading platform arrived. So we got that. Um, let's go over to Valhalla, see how its peoples are looking. We got enough gadgets to defrost some peoples. It looks like we do. And now we even get some more, so we get some unemployment. A lot oh, we can't defrost any more people. Achievement unlocked. We've defrosted everyone. We've got... A few more people than we do, so if we do this, that kicks our manpower to 95. That's fine with me, because that's going to give us a lot of money. What is this? Psychiatric care? How's our psychiatric? Psychiatric's good. We don't have enough people here to do anything else. So hopefully people just start getting born here, because who's celebrating? Oh, that's pretty. Look at it. They're celebrating victory over those evil... That's so pretty. They're still celebrating. They love to party here. Just constant partying. I love it. And you're at 52%. So we're going to leave it here. Eventually, next episode, we'll have the shoreline completed. And that'll be the 28th out of 29th thing. Um, we are trying to get more people born. Because now, at this point in the game, we just have to have people get born. That's the only way we can increase the population. So, uh, yeah. Thank y'all for joining me. And as always, see you next time. Bye, guys.